So kidney stones are really common in this area. Here in Raleigh, we live in what we call the stone belt. Um, in the southeast, where weather tends to be hot, there's a higher incidence of kidney stone disease in this particular area of the country. Kidney stone disease is more prevalent in men than women, although I see it in both all the time. Most commonly, the reason you know you have a kidney stone is you develop acute pain related to that. And the typical type of pain that you have from kidney stones um, would be severe, sudden onset, 10 out of 10 pain in, in the upper back, kind of right under the rib cage. The pain can be um, associated with nausea, vomiting, um, and often requires an emergency room visit to, to get it under control. You may be walking around with kidney stones and not even know it. It's when they drop into the tube and block the flow of urine from that kidney that causes the acute pain. Probably the biggest risk factor is that as a population we don't drink enough water and I usually recommend um, two to two and a half liters. The most common type of kidney stone is a calcium stone. Patients hear this and they think, oh, if I have calcium stones, I should stop eating calcium, and you absolutely should not do that. Um, studies have actually shown that sodium in the diet is a bigger risk factor for formation of kidney stones than calcium. The treatment of kidney stones kind of depends on where they are, how big they are, and how much pain they're causing, and if they're causing any other side effects. If you have a kidney stone and you develop a fever of greater than 101, um, that's an emergency and you should carry yourself on to the emergency department. Um, if you can't pass a stone on your own, then there's a couple of different ways that we treat kidney stones. Um, shockwave lithotripsy, where we actually um, bring you in for a procedure where we try to um, blast the stone with a special machine that we use. Uh, another common way to treat kidney stones is with ureteroscopy, which is actually where we um, bring you to the hospital for outpatient surgery and we drive a little camera up into your bladder and up into the ureter tube that drains the kidney. We can use very tiny lasers to break the stone up and pull it out.